which is PCOS. There are a number of women I've worked with who have PCOS. And through diet and balancing the adrenal hormones, we've been able to get their cycles back to normal so that they're actually able to conceive if they want to. Estrogen imbalance can be improved by eliminating estrogen containing foods such as commercially grown poultry and meats as well as dairy products. Such is as milk, all, all milk dairy, and cheese. All dairy or just, uh, um, if you're eating organically, it's much better because there are less of the chemicals used to produce the animals and make them grow faster, faster. So dairy are you products in general. More hormone -free Dairy, you're, you're okay. Better. Better. Some people are sensitive to milk. Milk has milk proteins, lactose, and milk fats. Those are the three primary things. And the milk proteins, for many people, are a source of sensitivity. If they are sensitive, it increases inflammatory responses in the body. That then causes the adrenals to kick in, which is, increases cortisol, which releases sugar in the bloodstream, which then causes the pancreas to produce, have to produce more insulin. So inflammation causes uh, uh, negative effects on blood sugar levels as well. So if you can reduce inflammation in the body, then you can keep your blood sugar more even. So it's kind of like a, a complicated side thing here. This is the chart that you have in your lecture notes, but I do not code them. Again, here we see green is the good, yellow is the faded yellow, and for that, and red is the ugly, as far as clearing estrogen out of the body. By the way, you also note up here is at the very top of that chart, in the upper left hand corner, what does that say? Right under influence. What word is on there? It starts with a C. Cholesterol. Cholesterol. So cholesterol, as you may know, is the building blocks of the steroid hormones in our body. We have to have cholesterol to produce estrogen, progesterone, testosterone, cortisol, androgen diet, etc. And where is cholesterol? How do we get cholesterol? Oils. Right? Dietary. What did you say? Dietary, dietary yeah. Dietary? That's 30%. But you generate yourself. Right? Yeah. We, we generate 70% of cholesterol in our liver. Because we have to have these hormones, and so our body is clever enough to produce cholesterol. If a person is under stress a lot, then it may be that there's a higher demand for cholesterol production. And so the body actually may be producing more cholesterol and the total cholesterol in the body may have increased because they're under stress and not just because uh, they need to have uh, or some other status drug. Estrogen dominance and balance may require the use of safe, non-carcinogenic, plant-based form of progesterone. Taking this lotion on the skin or under the tongue in liquid form, they may help restore hormone balances. So that's one of the ways that we sometimes treat as good dominance. What? Yeah. 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 Oh yeah, yes. And what idea? It's suggested that natural progesterone cream should say USP on the label. That signifies the progesterone is certified pharmaceutical grade and the highest quality. There are various herbs and supplements that can be beneficial in relieving these symptoms of PMS and menopause, such as lecithin. Eating primrose oil, go to cola, dongwai, black cocoa, sage, chase berry, red raspberry, leaf, and others. Women suffering from low blood sugar may also be misdiagnosed as having hormone problems. Of course, insulin and glucagon are part of the blood sugar metabolism, as is cortisol. So, in fact, it is having a hormone problem, but it's not female hormone. If you crave sweets, depend on caffeine, become drowsy in the middle of the afternoon, you may have low, low blood sugar and low adrenal function as well. So what can help you? Well, a diet free from junk food and white sugar is highly recommended. 
vitamins E and C, <coughs> essential fatty acids are important to normal hormone production. Calcium and magnesium are essential to prevent and treat osteoporosis. Avoid carbonated soft drinks because the phosphoric acid in them contributes to depleted calcium levels. Now with respect to calcium, we have to absorb all the nutrients through our digestive system, right? Yeah. What, what part of our digestive system absorbs nutrients? Mouth? Does it the whole thing? Throat? Just the intestine? The stomach? Yeah, the intestine, small intestine. Nutrients are absorbed through the small intestine. The, the saliva in the mouth starts to break down sugars and carbohydrates, and we chew it to make everything much smaller so it has more surface area for the enzymes and acid to work on. Once it gets in the stomach, stomach acid breaks down protein bonds. So that's part of our immune system. We want sufficient protein, uh, as hydrochloric acid in the stomach, to break down protein bonds. Anyone ever brought hydrochloric acid on their skin before? I don't advise it as an experiment, but what do you think would happen? Burns? It burns, yeah. What's burning mean? Is it oxidizing? Um, yeah, yeah, good guess. Um, Acidic? Well, it's, it's breaking the protein bonds down. Our skin and all parts of our body have protein in there holding it together. Mm -hmm. So it breaks the protein bonds down so we're actually eating away the skin and the other tissues. That's what our stomach does in a protected environment. It breaks down protein bonds and also kills off bacteria and viruses. So anyone ever heard of Thomas? Yeah. Yeah. Thomas, yeah. What is it? It's an acid supposedly. It's calcium carbonate. So I've, I've been to some offices, like OBGYN GYN offices, and they have these big posters, get your calcium, take times. For one thing, it deacidifies the stomach, and that's not good for your immune system or breaking down protein. Number two, calcium carbonate is very poorly absorbed. That is why amino acid chelated minerals were developed in the first place. It's because you're attaching a mineral to an amino acid and the body is tricked into thinking it is a protein. So it's one of the last things it'll stop absorbing. Calcium carbonate's not well absorbed, number one. And number two, once you absorb calcium, where does it go in your body? Well, it's used in muscles, it's used in nerves, it's used in all the cells, and it's stored in the bones. So if you're deficient, then you're gonna be pulling calcium out to do other things anyway. And there are only a couple kinds of uh, calcium that have actually been studied and we know they go to the bone. The microcrystalline hydroxyapatite, which is a bone matrix, is the only thing that they actually studied. They radioactive and tagged it. Calcium and magnesium are essential to prevent and treat osteoporosis, but if you're really trying to treat it, then you need to have the right calcium. It costs more, but at least you know it's getting to the bone and it's well absorbed compared to calcium carbonate and other forms. And again, as we were talking before, it, you're benefited in general switching to free range range, free range race, chicken, organic meats, and organic whole milk to avoid the <coughs> hormones added to beef and poultry. Of course, too much tension and stress can cause a malfunction of your organ system. Research has shown acupuncture could be significantly helpful in alleviating hot flashes in the short term. That study also showed a persistent decrease in hot flashes after a three month follow up. Another study showed a clear decrease in both menstrual pain and the use of pain medications from a simple course of acupuncture therapy. So, acupuncture is another avenue to use. Many people do not realize um, acupuncture is required to complete a four year postgraduate degree with various subjects in science, biochemistry, microbiology, pathology, public health, uh, clinical disciplines, in addition to agriculture and herbs. Yeah. I think you put a little bit more money in my meter. Anyone else have to? I do too. Okay. <laughs> right, yeah. so we're going to take a quick break. I'm just recording myself. So I can put this